Hi everybody. How's everybody doing today? Well, it's about, it's close to 5 o'clock in the morning. Nothing's really going on. I um, haven't been to bed yet. Um, don't really know what I've got to say. Um, been looking through everybody's videos. Kind of made some video responses tonight. Um, seems like it's taken the computer a long time to upload everything. Or, um, yeah, upload, I guess. Download, upload, whatever the hell you call it. I don't know. Anyway, sitting here, um, nothing's on TV, and, um, I don't know. Just got a lot of things running through my mind, and, um, my boyfriend today has been very distant. And, um, it's kind of bothering me. Um, I guess maybe I'll talk about that for a minute. He's having a hard time. Um, he, he probably wouldn't like me talking about this, but he's got a truck that his payment is very high. And, um, he's trying to trade it in and he's trying to get rid of the truck so he can, um, you know, get a lower payment on something else and nobody wants to trade it um, because his um, <clears throat> name is still on his wife's house or their names are still in the house together and it's a whole bunch of bullshit and um, he can't get his name off the house um, without there being a um, large um, fee involved. Something like that. I, I don't understand all that bullshit. But anyway, um, his name is on, on the house where she's living and his name is also on her car. So it's a big, big thing and he's completely upset and I understand that. but. He's been, like, really, really distant today, and, and I've been here all week, and I kind of feel like I need to, like, just, like, pack my belongings up and just, like, head out and just give him some, like, space or whatever, but I don't really want to, but then again, I, I feel like maybe I need to, so it's, like, 5 o'clock, and usually he calls me when he's at work, and... Um, or usually I call him and he stops in to say hi or something, but, um, he hasn't done that tonight. He hasn't called and I made my mind up that, that I wouldn't call him and bother him. Um, he, um, is in, I don't really want to say exactly what he does, but he is not in the law enforcement field and, um. So he can pretty much drop by when he wants to. Um, you know, as long as he doesn't stay very long. He, he drops in, like, on his lunch break or whatever. But now his shift is coming to an end pretty soon. So um, he's probably already took lunch and is probably took lunch with his buddies. So I'm kind of, you know down that he hasn't called me or you know come by and see me or something and um he kind of left the house abruptly tonight you know he gave me just a little peck on the cheek and he was out the door and um i fell asleep on the couch and he went to the bedroom and went to bed, and he never did wake me, so I could, like, go and sleep with him or nothing, so, I don't know, um, maybe I'm just being, maybe I'm just being a woman, maybe I'm just being sentimental or emotional, or maybe it's just my depression medicine playing tricks with my mind, maybe it is my mind, hell, who knows, I don't even know. 
If you have any suggestions, throw them at me. <laughs> I'm ready for anything. All in all, it's been a pretty boring day. I've um, not done anything, actually, but lay around and um, I've been in my pajamas all day long. Um, <clears throat> finally took a shower a while ago. Um, my hair is still actually wet, and um, I always look like hell on here. Some of you guys look so really pretty on here when you talk. Your hair is all beautiful, and you've got makeup on, and you look really nice. And me, I, I look like a dog, basically. But, um... I don't have any makeup on, and I haven't been going to the tanning bed, so I'm like completely white. Usually I go to the tanning bed and everything, but being as I'm here with my boyfriend, I'm, I haven't been going because um, the tanning bed is where I live, and um, I live an hour from where he does, so anyway haven't been working. I'm starting to get anxiety about going back to work. I go back to work on Sunday night and I'm kind of worried about what everybody's going to ask me. They're going to ask me, how are you feeling? And, and all that kind of stuff. I'm hoping that they're not going to ask me questions about, well, what, what was wrong? And why were you off? And are you glad to be back and shit like that? I don't want to say, you know, I hope they don't think, oh God, she had a mental breakdown and, and all this crap. Um, so, I'm kind of worried about what they're going to ask me and, and um, stuff like that. But, anyway, um, I don't really know much to say other than, um... I'm just still battling this depression and um, kind of wor uh, and worried about my boyfriend and um, I'm just not very happy right now. Um, I love being with him, but he's just being very distant right now, and um, maybe I'm being distant too. I, I really don't know. Um, I really don't know what to say. I wish I, I knew. Um, I feel like I'm eating all the time because I'm around the house all the time. I don't really want to go out. Um, I thought about going to our good old friendly old Walmart that most people know around here in the U.S. Um, I don't know other people, um, from other places probably don't know, but everybody in the good old U.S. of A. knows uh, our local Walmart. Thought about doing that tonight, but then if I go to Walmart, I'll spend money that I don't have, so I decided not to do that and take a shower and turn on the TV and there's nothing on the TV, so here I am sitting in front of the video camera or the camera here and talking to y'all. And my time is going to run out, so um, I guess I'll leave it at that and see you all another day, another time, another place. Um, I'll catch you right here. Hope you all are having a good, good day, better than me, and um, I'll talk to you soon. And um, I hope everyone is happy and well and all is going well. Bye.